fans are coming out here to show their support. There is a small memorial growing outside of the Roscoe's where PNB Rock was fatally shot. And many people are sharing personal stories with us about how his music and how his message inspired and impacted them. It's your boy, Porter Flacco. Anywhere you go, anybody you know, somebody got to know me. And we're back again with another one, folks. Now, check it out. But, folks, the conversations are defense. And the favorite of PNB Rock's girlfriend was, how do you guys know that the killers or killer got the drop from her IG? How do you guys know they was following his girl? That's been the defense of her. Now, the cops just confirmed that. They believe uh, that the killers got the drop from not only PNB Rock's girlfriend's Instagram, but his Instagram as well. Because PNB Rock, I believe, did a live in the parking lot of the Roscoe's with like 50 chains on. Now, let's be real, bro. These rent -a cops in LA don't know much better, brother. <laughs> let's be real here, man. Like, these rent -a cops, these Paul Blurt uh, cops, they don't know nothing. Bro, they don't know no more than we do. Let's be real here. They haven't found the killers. How do they know the motive? Right? So I don't even think we can really take this, you know, with too much, like, I guess, seriousness, right? You know, we got to take this with a grain of salt. Them cops telling us that the killers got the drop from PNB's Instagram and from the girlfriend's IG, we can take that with a grain of salt. Because, one, they haven't found the killers yet. They, they have no clue who the killers are. They don't even know the direction the killer's car went into. So how can you guys tell us what the motive is? Right now, I just hope, I honestly just hope, because we've seen with Tupac, with Biggie, with even Pop Smoke, right? We've seen how these cops drag their feet. They, bro, they drag their feet when it comes to these investigations, yo. Thank God, like, Pop Smoke killers got caught, right? But it took, like, what, a year or two before that happened? Right? So, hopefully, 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 whoever did it gets caught in the immediate. Hopefully, this is not an investigation that drags on and lags on for about a year or two. Because let's be real, bro. In a year or two, now, the police was lucky that Pop Smoke's killers were all, like, underage. Right? Those were all, like, young kids. If you waiting for a year or two for an adult, a fully grown savage in his, let's say, 20s or 30s, if you give him a year or two, he's going. He's going to Alaska somewhere, going to Cuba, going to Mexico. He's getting up out of here. Mexico is, like, a three-hour drive. He's up out of here. Oh, he's gone. He's gone. So let's just hope, let's just hope, let's just hope the investigation don't, don't take too long, bro. But after these comments, man, I'll be real with y'all, man. I'm not really encouraged because this comes off as if the police is more concerned with the public perception and the public thinking they're doing something than I'm actually doing something, all right? It's your boy, Portic Flacco, man. Like the video, sub to the channel, comment for the algorithm, bro. I'm going to keep you guys updated through this whole pain rock situation, all right? It's your boy, Porter Flacco. I'm out of here, folks. Peace.